I'm Adam Handing, chef owner of the Frog Restaurant in London. So the dish I'm going to make today using Kickerman's natural brewed soy sauce is English tomatoes, acidulated soy and roasted red pepper. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to make that acidulated soy. How I'm going to do that is adding lemon juice to soy sauce and then just for a bit of heat we're going to finish it with some red Tabasco. We're going to marinate our already blanched and peeled cherry tomatoes in there. This doesn't take long, leave it in there for about 5 minutes and then we're going to use them to plate up. I think one of the things my brand and the Kickerman brand has in common is the fact is that very minimal ingredients are used to make a product. It's completely natural. Kickermans use four, four natural ingredients to make their soy. I only put about three to four components on a plate at one time. So the synergy there about making something taste so incredible but not overcomplicating it, I think it's a beautiful marriage. I'm going to make a frozen tomato snow by blending tomatoes with onions, with garlic, with spring onions, seashell leaves and a little bit of vodka and then we're going to season that with soy rather than using salt to bring out that umami flavour of that tomato. After blended, we're going to pass it through a cheesecloth where we let it sit and filter naturally so it becomes nice and clear. Then from there we're going to pour the tomato juice in a bowl, whisk continuously while pouring liquid nitrogen to make little ice crystals. To plate up the dish we're going to add some roasted red pepper puree and then we're going to add four of the tomatoes. Depending on size you can add more or you can add less and then we're going to add a spoon of that acidulated soy. Right there adds lots of different levels of flavour already. We're going to finish it with a frozen tomato snow and then to garnish it we're going to place on a twill made from the skins of the tomatoes and the red peppers that we've peeled already. So when using tomatoes, they are massively high in umami. They're also high in water. If you pair that with a soy sauce accompaniment or a dressing, that brings out the flavor of tomato on completely new heights. And you get a really tasty tomato dish when instead of seasoning it with salt where you flavor the water, you season it with soy and you get the tomato flavor. So here we have it, my English tomatoes, acidulated soy and roasted red pepper.